And gyms are also on that non-essential shutdown list. But neighbors in Norwood Park tell CBS2 there's at least one gym that doesn't seem to have racked their weights. So we sent our Charlie DeMar to check it out. This nondescript gym is 24-7, but it should be closed. It's considered a non-essential business. But neighbors, they've been keeping a close eye, and they actually have proof that this key access pad has been put to good use. Because isn't it closed for the shutdown? No. It's still open? No, it's closed. It's closed? Yeah. The windows are dark. The sign says closed. Hello, you have reached MBS 24-7 Fitness. We are a 24-hour key card gym located in Norwood Park. Nobody picks up the phone, but that isn't keeping people away from MBS 24-7 Fitness. Another person leaves that gym. Neighbors started taking video and snapping pictures of people coming and going regularly from the Norwood Park neighborhood gym. Despite the state order to stay at home and shut down non-essential businesses like gyms. What kind of standard is that setting? What kind of, you know, um, what is that saying to our children? You know, we, we tell them to, you know, obey authority and to do the right thing. And then there's people that find it above the law to do that. This longtime neighborhood resident says she was surprised to see the access key card still working, considering who she sees as frequent customers. It's, you know, very apparent that a lot of police officers and firefighters both use the facilities, I mean, as well as other members of the community. All right, these guys are going to the gym. As recently as this morning, cell phone video from neighbors shows people entering the gym. They just went in? Are you I've been kidding me? Yes, it's still open. Apparently bending iron, not the COVID curve. When I saw people walking in and out with their water jugs, from my apartment, how does that make me feel? Isn't it closed for the shutdown? No. This afternoon, this guy decided to end his workout before it began once we started asking questions. Now it is dark, the lights are off, nobody is inside. We have tried calling several times. We have reached out to the owner of the gym and still have not heard back. In Norwood Park, Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News.